Good morning, friends. Uh, I'm Rahul, and Justin already gave my introduction. I'm really honored and thankful to all of you for giving me an opportunity to represent Droices and the Droices Cloud Showcase here today. What an amazing day. We have had some of the best industry speakers and guests speak about different topics. And I'm really thankful to our chairman, Sanjeev Goel, our CEO, Amit Goel, for inspiring us to put this summit together. It has been a wonderful day so far. Now, in my session, I'll be talking about our journey, building the Droices Cloud. You know, all my friends, even till date, my friends back from school even ask me, what is cloud? You know, and I just tell them, it's like, you know, hiring a cab. You just, you know, get in it. You just use the services, the internet, and you get off wherever you want. That's what, that is what is cloud. It is like using somebody else's computer to do your job on the cloud, you know, and they get it. So we'll be talking about, you know, the role of cloud computing, how it has underpinned the world economy during this coronavirus pandemic. You know, you can see that during this pandemic, we have survived because of the role of technology that it has played in our lives. You know, be it education for our children, they are plugged in on the Zoom all the time for their classroom lessons, whether it is plugging into a remote workplace or even feeding us by ordering food from DoorDash and other providers. It is all through the underpinning technology and the power of the cloud. It is keeping us going. Our economy is super tight. It is all, we should thank the cloud and the power of computing. We are all in, in this age. You know, I started working almost 20 years ago as an undergrad with my university. I was responsible for managing a network of 1000 plus computers connected with Windows NT back in 2000. You know, and we have seen technology evolve in the last two decades from just computers being connected with very limited processing storage and computing power to the power of the cloud we have today. You know, today we leverage the cloud, not only for, you know, getting the applications done, we leverage cloud as more than all of our speakers mentioned, even to feed us, we use cloud, we order all our grocery on the cloud, you know, we go to work on the cloud, you know, even the cloud has, has at some, with some way helped become, make this planet a greener planet because the pollution levels are all time low across the globe. You know, look at countries like India where the pollution has gone down and why people are able to work and survive through the pandemic. It's all the power of the cloud here. You know, I have seen technology from very limited dial up internet to the 5G data we have on our phones now, which is promising almost a gigabit of data. What are we going to do with it? You know, I'm truly amazed with the power the how you can deploy and create applications with the cloud and on demand, you can turn on these services, tap into different data streams, you know, and build your applications and deploy them on the fly. That is what we do here with Royce's cloud. You know, but we have to agree, technology can't do it all alone. Companies must have an agile backbone of people, systems, processes to be able to easily adapt to new technology, you know, me, you know, at Royces, I feel very proud to be associated with this organization where our innovation teams, you heard Pratik and Manoj earlier today, and all of our global teams ac spread across six different offices globally are doing some very, very amazing work. You show, they showcase some of the videos on what we are doing with AI, ML, all that cloud computing, and we are empowering all different verticals in retail, CPG, pharma, healthcare, and, to name a few. So we can see that in the last decade, we have seen, you know, cloud has empowered our lives in some or the other way. We do our banking, our education, transaction, food, all in the cloud. Let me tell you a little bit about Droice's cloud. In the last 10 years, Droice's cloud has empowered not only the Fortune 1000 companies globally in six continents with some or the other application and services, we have also brought to life the ideas and vision of hundreds of small and medium enterprises and entrepreneurs and helped transform their dreams into reality by leveraging the services capabilities of our cloud platform in one or the another way. How many of you have you know, traveled to Vegas and played on the slot machines, interacted with the kiosks to get your card printed, to get your information? How many of you have 
looked for places where you can go for sample testing? Have you ever gone for wine tasting? You know, have you ever seen apps that can save your life while driving? We have done so much in the last decade building our cloud. And today in my session, you know, I'll be walking you through some of the great use cases and the business problems that we have solved with technology as a backbone. You know, before we talk about what we did and what we do here, you know, I would like to tell you everything at Droises starts with why. You know, we, we don't work as vendors for our clients. We work as partners. We try to work very closely with the business, with the technology teams, and try to understand, you know, what is the real business problem? You know, we don't focus on just hunkering down and trying to write the code and slapping it back on their face and saying that this is solving their problem. You know, what we try to focus is on, on the big why. You know, we, we at Droises harp on curiosity. You know, curiosity is the big thing here. We, sh we focus on understanding the business problem, whether it is, you know, uh, running the national lottery in Latin America, whether it is running the raffle 50-50 during the entire NBA season in Minneapolis, or it is running field survey across the nation, or it is maintaining 400 plus brand micro websites for the largest cereal brand in the country, or even running a successful QR based campaign for two years for our best catch-up company, number one catch-up company. You know, we have done it all by getting down to the problem. What is the problem? And let me walk you through a few use cases here. And I'm getting some questions here about cloud. You know, all I can tell you is, you know, when it rains, you will know. So let me, let me talk about a few use cases which we focused on in the last decade in CPG, gaming, you know, healthcare and pharma. I mentioned uh, the largest catch-up company in the world came to us and said, you know, we don't have access to the operators where our product is served. We want to run a campaign across North America and Canada through which we can collect all the information about these restaurants where people go out and eat and feed themselves our product. We have to collect their data. We said, okay, let's create a campaign around it. Let's because the only way you can do that is you know, you have to create engagement. You have to use and tap into the power of the customers who walk in into these restaurants and bars rather than just having people go out and collect this data. Our QR code powered by Droysis Cloud was printed on almost a billion ketchup bottles back in the year 2013 to 2015. What that QR code did for us and for the company, for our client, anytime a customer walked into a restaurant, while they were waiting for the food to arrive, you know, they can scan the QR code on the back of the bottle and the QR code will bring up their location. Based on the location, it will suggest, are you in this particular restaurant? And if a customer marks it as yes, we know this particular location is an operator. That is how we ran that campaign across the country. You will be amazed to know we collected unbelievably 2.4 million unique emails from America. That is almost 1% of the entire population in a year. And then the campaign was converted for, for Spanish and it was spread across Canada for an, another year. We even had people play the campaign almost 10 times throughout the year, every time they went to the restaurant. So what we do here is we try to understand the problem and try to create an engagement that is going to not only provide and collect the data, serve the KPIs for our clients, but also bring engagement to the operators, for the operators, for the customers as a whole. Let me talk about the another use case with Royce's Cloud. How do you empower a customer to maintain 500 plus digital assets or micro websites on the cloud? How do you empower the brand managers you know, to run or create their micro sites for their brands and promote them on the internet. It's so hard for any company of whatever size to be able to stand up a platform that gives the ability to their brand managers to create or source the digital assets at one place. With Royce's Cloud, we were able to create and give them a platform where the brand managers can come in 
use templates for their websites, drag and drop their master data, all the digital assets at one place and create these micro websites for 500 plus brands and deploy them on the fly. That's the power of the Droices Cloud. Another client, the largest hospital equipment manufacturer in the world, they had a unique problem. They said our sales reps go out to these hospitals and they are tasked with doing a survey of the condition of the equipment so that we can make a sales pitch as to what equipment needs to be replaced. And this is what I'm talking about early in 2010s. How do you empower the sales reps with technology in a way that empowers business in a very unique way that brings cost efficiency, business continuity, and even helps sales? We created a mobility-based solution where these sales reps will walk into the hospitals without you know, stepping on anybody's privacy or looking like robots walking down with huge laptops collecting photos and images with DSLR cameras. A single iPad application you know, where they can walk into the hospital beds, take a few pictures, and with the power of AI, you know, we could sense the condition of the equipment and create a report with all the data piped into the Droices cloud. And that report about the hospital equipment will then be used by the sales team to create a pitch for their clients. Wow, there are like hundreds of sales reps using that at their company even today. We even created a dynamic field survey application for one of our biggest wine manufacturers in the country where their field reps are collecting data about their brands, their competitor brands from the retail stores every single day. You know, when you go for wine tasting, you play at any slots in the casino, you interact with the kiosks. You have at some point in your life, even if you have bought a raffle 50-50 ticket, or if you have traveled to Latin America and you have bought a scratch card lottery ticket, I can guarantee you have interacted with part of our platform or services from our platform in some or the other way without even realizing that Droices Cloud is the underpinning technology that has helped you, you know, get something done in your life. We are powering not only gaming, CPG, we are even in healthcare, you know, we are even helping our clients in healthcare to do more, help us recover our mortality rates, you know, make us a living. Have you ever been thrown or pushed you have got a notification on your phone when you walk into grocery stores or any uh, electronic stores. Have you got a coupon delivered on your phone as a notification? You have seen the power of the Droices Cloud by using technologies like NFC, Beacon. We have empowered businesses to be able to deliver relevant content and campaigns to the clients based on their location, their presence on the go. We have done so much in the last decade. If I keep on talking about this, this will be like the whole day. I'll be talking about the success stories and examples of Royce's Cloud. But what really keeps us going? You know, as our chairman quotes very confidently, if your business problem can be solved with technology, we at Royce's can do it. And I completely believe in that mantra. That is the mantra that has kept us going over years and years and helped us work with all of our clients, business associates and partners to solve their problems in technology. We are even, we even empowered the global Pan IIT summit that happened like two weeks ago with our cloud technology where we empowered startups and investors to come to our platform with the Pan IIT app to come and show interest and fund all the different initiatives the global and IIT teams were doing. It was a phenomenal event and the power of the cloud was leveraged. Royces Cloud was leveraged in that event. You know, our motto has been since the beginning, embrace innovation, whatever we do here, you know, we try to solve the problems in a unique way. Let me try to explain you when I talk about innovation, what do we do here? I spoke about these sales reps walking into the retail stores and counting the bottles on the shelves. Well, you know, you give them a mobility solution. They can key in the numbers of how many bottles they see in the store or how many products they see on the shelves. But how do you take it far? How do you take it to the next level? How do you take it to the next curve with innovation, computer vision, technology? You know, what we did was, I said, today's generation, the generation Y, the generation Z, millennials, they all believe in visual communication. Back in our days, when I was in school, we used to write letters to our friends. We used to mail them. Today, do you see that happening? 
no today's generation believes in the power of visual communication they communicate through social media they communicate visually through pictures videos photos and what are we doing here today we are communicating through the power of the technology so we said why don't we transform the excel or the device or app based survey into something which can be done more visually which can be done leveraging the power of conversational intelligence chatbots how about these users walking into the stores and taking pictures of the products and using our computer vision and ai technology at roises cloud we can ourselves identify from our algorithms that what products were out there and generate a report on the fly that is what we do here every day you know how amazing is that that you just walk in into a store take a few pictures or a video and as soon as you walk out or before you walk out a report about the store and what is out there is generated for you on the fly and as a sales person if you walk in into a store if we can tell you what are the most important you know objectives you have to work on what are the most important things you have to do today that is how we leverage cloud we don't want to overwhelm anyone with data or information the real power of the cloud comes to play only when it can deliver the right content to the right person in the right point in time that is what is leveraging cloud that is what we do throughout our lives every single day you know we at roises we are a very agile and nimble team we believe in failing fast and moving forward we learn from our failures i'm not saying that we haven't had any failures failures is something that has kept us going because with our failures we have learned million ways of how not to do the things we have understood that technology only plays a important role when we try to understand and connect humans with technology try to understand the problem try to understand the human behavior try to understand why they want to use technology and then we come up with a solution whether it is using ai ml and all the buzzwords we have it all in our portfolio but we again we believe in breaking new ground by finding unique ways to solve problem i would welcome all of you to come and join and you know visit our websites and see all the amazing work we have done and how we are breaking new ground every other day in one or more verticals you know i'm thankful to all my clients colleagues and the team at droises you know who have shown the confidence and the trust in us to be able to deliver on our promise it is it is huge you know i don't have anything else to say you will be hearing the man of the memory in the next session and i don't want you to be waiting for that enough from me thank you have a amazing day